Hey everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Tammy and this is Happiness Created. Today's video is part of the five under five open playlist. It is hosted monthly by Missy from Crafty Cove and Emily from Farm Charm Chic. And this month's guest host is Elizabeth from Southern G More Gals. I will have all of their links as well as the playlist in my description box down below. Now this month is last minute gift ideas. So I put together some gift ideas for you, uh, all Dollar Tree products. So hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully you get some inspiration and let's get into it. Okay, gift idea number one. So I got one of the mugs from the Dollar Tree and some of these, they're those puffy mint candies. They're so delicious. Uh, Swiss Miss uh, hot cocoa with marshmallows, of course, and some shortbread cookies. So what I'm gonna do is I have, um, oh, I also got one of those two packs of gift bags. So I'm just going to take one of the gift bags and I am going to grab some tissue paper and I'm going to put some tissue paper inside the bag to start. And then I'm going to remove the mug from the box and I'm going to take a couple of the hot cocoa packets and I'm going to put those in the cup and then I'm going to take some of the uh, peppermint candies. Now I was looking for those the sticks like the peppermint sticks and I could not find those to save my soul so I went with the next best thing here so I'm just going to add a few of those into the cup and then I'm going to place the cup into the bag along with the cookies and then I'm going to take another piece of tissue paper and I'm just going to cover everything up with that piece. And that's it for this one. I think it would be super cute for teacher or maybe a daycare provider. Let me know what you guys think of that one. Now I know it says DIY number two, but we're going with gift idea number two. <laughs> So I have some of that shredded paper, decorative shreds, I guess it's called, I don't know. One of these gift boxes. Um, and then I got, it's a like a neck gaiter thing. I, it just covers your neck so you're not cold. <laughs> um, and then a scarf, a pair of gloves and a hat now this is more for a man but of course you can change out the colors of everything and it can be for a woman as well so i'm taking some of that decorative shredded paper and i'm going to just put some in the bottom of this box now i didn't put too too much because in the end you really can't see it so you could kind of skip this part if you wanted to or you could just use tissue paper whatever you wanted so i'm taking the scarf and i'm just gonna roll it onto the little um cardboard packaging thing and then i'm going to take the neck gator thing and roll that up and then I add the gloves in 
Um, and I'm not pushing everything way down because I want it to kind of appear like it's pretty full. I mean, it is pretty full, but you know what I mean. And then I'm just going to take the hat and I fold that into thirds and I'm just going to stick that right in uh, the box. And that's it for this one. I think it's super cute. And again, it could be for a teacher or a karate instructor or, you know, something along those lines. Let me know what you think of this one. So I want to let you know I am on Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest. I also have a Buy Me a Coffee page. I will have all of those links in my description box down below. Stop on by and say hi. I'd love to hear from you. Gift idea number three. So I have another one of these gift boxes and some more of that shredded paper. Um, I got some of this room spray. It's apple cinnamon. It smells really, really good, guys. And I got an apple cinnamon candle. And I also got two books with some scriptures. So one of them says Grace on the cover, and it's got blue pages. They're beautiful, really, um, for, you know, anybody religious in your family or friends. And this one says Faith. It's a little harder to see the words because of the coloring, but beautiful nonetheless. So I'm going to take some more of that decorative paper I think I might have already said that sorry if I did <laughs> and then I you know it was kind of sinking a little bit so I just took a, a bag and I kind of stuffed it under the shreds and then I'm going to put the two books in and I'm trying to stand them up so that you can see both of them and then I am going to add the candle into the box and the room spray. And that's it for this one. I think it came out really, really sweet. I think any woman in your life would love this gift. So let me know what you think of this one. Okay, gift idea number four. So I found these really adorable glasses. It says Mr. and Mrs. and it's got the little Santa hat. I thought they were so cute. And then this is some non-alcoholic sangria and some um, Snyder's, they're honey wheat or wheat honey <laughs> pretzels, anyway. And then I got this container from the Dollar Tree as well. Now, I know that these are all kind of $5.25, right? Or is it six, $6.25? Sorry. <laughs> but I didn't include the packaging because you probably can find something that you have at home anyway. So... All I did was I added some of the decorative shredded paper stuff and then I put the two glasses in and the pretzels in the center and then I just laid the bottle of sangria down um, so you could see the label. And then I did add a few pieces of those uh, peppermint candies. And that's it for this one. I love this one. This is something I would love to receive. Uh, but let me know what you guys think. Gift idea number five, it's the last one. So I found this little mousse. It's a stuffed mousse. I thought it was adorable. And then I found this um, toy which is kind of like a light bright from when I was a kid and then a little travel etch-a-sketch which I thought was so cute and then these are color forms this shoots and ladder game 
I thought this was a really cool idea for any kid that you have in your life. Well, I mean, in that age group. <laughs> so anyways, I have these cloth bags that I got at the Dollar Tree. They come to, to a package. So I'm just going to take one of them. Now, full disclosure, I had to redo this one because these bags are super thin. And when I went to pull on the ties, I ended up popping the chutes and ladder box right out the side. So just be careful. Don't tug on it too much. But anyway, so I'm just loading all of the toys into this cute little Christmas sack. And then I just tie the top and that's all there is to this one. I think, again, any little kid in your life, you know, within that age range, I think they would love to have this kind of a gift. But let me know what you guys think. So I want to thank Missy, Emily, and Elizabeth for hosting this awesome playlist. I love this one. It's one of my favorites. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a great big thumbs up for me. It really helps me out. If you're new to my channel or coming over from the playlist, welcome. I hope you'll consider sticking around and hit that subscribe button and don't forget the bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. I thank you so much for spending some of your time with me today and I will see you next time.